a very good afternoon and heartily welcome to honorable dignitaries and participants present here i am dr jageshwar kekke coordinator of this webinar feel privilege to extend warm welcome in today's webinar on essence of data science and opportunities for graduates light is a symbol of brightness and prosperity as sunlight expresses the darkness of might similarly blessings brings in our life prosperity and happiness at the outset i pay my humble homage to the founder president of sri shivaji education society amravati dr punjab rao alias bhau saheb deshmukh as well as rashtra sant tukro ji maharaj a spiritual leader after whom nagpur university is named as rashtra sant tukro ji maharaj nagpur university nagpur it is my proud privilege to welcome our dignitaries of this event president of today's program and chairman of this webinar honorable principal professor mp dore sir science college congress nagar nagpur resource persons respected dr arshad sharif sir and mr anil tatore sir convener of this webinar and hod of computer science department respected professor sr pandey sir dear participants ug and pg students faculties and researchers welcomes you all the purpose of this webinar is to gain something new about the data science to understand the dynamics of the data science market to understand the importance of learning data science skills in the current era tips and techniques to build a career in this competitive field we are very fortunate to have great personality as our resource persons now it is my honor to introduce today's speaker dr arshad sharif sir he is an academic head at department of cloud technology oberai center for excellence that is oce rashtra sant tukro ji maharaj nagpur city nagpur he is an expert committee member in board of studies in computer science for swarnim gandhinagar gujarat as well as nagindas khandwala college mumbai maharashtra he is certified and licensed professional engineer in networking and project management by engineering council of india new delhi he has total 15 plus years experience 2 plus years industry and 13 years academic his area of expertise is ai that is artificial intelligence and machine learning he has published 15 plus technical and research paper he is a member associated member and life member for various national and international and technical and research bodies like ieee iste cscl acm ncss iisca iaeng uacee and iacspt he is a editorial board member and reviewer for various technical journals of india and abroad he has delivered many seminars webinars workshops training and development programmers for it and non it students faculty across india he is a recipient of 16 national and international awards for contribution towards education research and development by various recognized bodies on india uh, in india and abroad <clears throat> now it is time to start the interaction with our eminent resource person and participants first resource person of the technical session is dr arshad sharif sir now i request dr arshad sharif sir to guide the students please sir yes uh, very good afternoon everyone uh, thank you jageshwar sir uh, for your kind uh, you know notes on what has been said so far it's really a privilege to be here uh, to be a part of you know your team and students and students fraternity 
Uh, am I audible to everyone? Please acknowledge. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Wonderful. Thank you so much. Uh, so, um, without making you know most of the time, I'll I'll just share the screen with you. Please acknowledge uh, once the screen is visible to everyone. Uh, is the screen visible? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. yes wonderful. Yes, so, so guys, uh, basically, right, uh, we are here, uh, you know, to discuss and uh, uh, disperse the things uh, that we are looking for, that we are seeking for, that is the sense of uh, data science and opportunities for the graduates, okay. So what is data science, uh, why it is prevailing, what are the, you know, major benefits and what we are getting uh, out of this once we are done with this and what are the future promises, future, uh, you know, incomings on this, all this we are going to see. And uh, before starting this, uh, what I would like to request everyone, uh, let's not make this as a you know classroom lecture. Okay, what I want everyone to please be interactive, be attentive, and I want your interaction more rather than my you know uh, deliverance. Okay, that makes the sessions much more you know interesting and important. So I'm basically not here to explain you know, the theoretical part of what is what. Yes, obviously we have you know some discussion points on this. Apart from this, we'll also see uh, what is this course about and uh, uh, what we are exactly trying to get once we are you know getting uh, this kind of course done and what is the you know job perspective future perspective of this course okay so uh, this is what is uh, uh, basically the outline uh, uh, we start with the, you know, the basic introduction part and the, from there we start with uh, the need for data science why we need a data science what was before data science and what we are doing with the data science as of now and obviously the applications as well as the challenges and the cycle okay how this uh, data science process starts what is the process of the data science agar aap seek rahe ho, then what are the tools what are the algorithms and what kind of projects we have done so far and once we are done with this we'll also you know discuss about the career and opportunities the most important part of this webinar okay so basically uh, normally the students or you know the uh, aspirants those who learn the data science obviously they will ask Sir, okay, I'm done with learning all these concepts. And what is the, you know, the final part of this? What I'm going to get once I'm done with this? So what is the job prospect? What is the future prospect of this data science? So all this we are going to, you know, discuss. I'm not saying, you know, we are going to uh, make it as a theoretical session. Your uh, interaction and everything uh, matters here. So if you ask you, uh, any one of you, you know, obviously, uh, most of you might be aware of this. Can anyone give me a basic definition of data science? Not a textual definition, or what do you feel, or what do you you know uh, understand by uh, hearing the word data science? Anyone? Would you, your thought, your perspective? Kya lagta hai apko? Kya data science ka definition kya hona chahiye? Kya ho sakta hai? The management of a data. Uh, management of a data. Noted. Good name, please. Mr. Rushikesh. Rushikesh said management of the data. Wonderful. Anyone else? Sir, or we can say that it is the operations that we can perform on data. Operations on the data. Very good. And and any more answers? Yes, you are good. I'm not just asking you know the uh, text, textual definition or any other definition. Understand to data. Sorry? Yeah, please. Understand to data. Understanding of the data. Good name? Pratamesh Kulunga. Sorry? Pratamesh. Pratamesh. Pratamesh said understanding of the data. Management of the data, operations of the data, understanding of the data. Okay. And use of data. Yes. Use of data. Use of data. To convert a trash data into useful way. Useful data. Wonderful. Uh, your good day? Yes, Lichade. Right. So, you know, two or three of you has given very wonderful answers with regard to the definition of the data science, which is, you know, correct at your ends. And obviously, you know, involves somewhere or the other the total definition of that data, uh, data science. Okay. So understanding of the data, use of the data, management of the data and operations of the data. All these are part of your data. Okay. 
so one more question for you again not uh, uh, any technical question or not any uh, textual question what do you think who is generating the data on every day basis kon generate kar raha hai data every day basis every person we use mobiles every person technology is the mobile who is using the technology right so pratmesh whatever we, we are working user. that become a data right wonderful so what you said is right whoever is using you know the computing devices it may be a laptop it may be a computer it may be a, a mobile phone or it may be desktop computer or it may be a, any kind of you know machine that is directly connecting with the internet and uh, who is also operating round the clock round the globe 24/7 so everywhere every second every minute every hour every day every month every year data is being generated right Wonderful. So, what you said is right. So, connecting to that, the same question in continuation with that. Just, just give me a, a number. Okay, how much data is being generated on every day basis? And can you guess a number? Un data. Unlimited. 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 Who's so in that? billions. Yeah, correct. So, what you said, sir. Har uh, koi data generate kar raha hai. Hundred percent right. and every day data is being generated across the globe everyone is connected to the internet uh, you know online offline data is generated data is generated everywhere data 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 right and when i ask or when i say or when i you know think okay, what is the size of the data that is being generated every day i'm not in saying bytes, about bytes yeah bytes bytes or you know uh, do, do do you think do, do we actually have you know some sort of measurement that we can measure ke daily kitna data generate ho raha internet se maybe in 2 3 uh, 2 million go terabytes terabytes or you know much more than ha two terabytes right? something so i'm talking in terms of memory jahan pe database store ho raha hai just just a number again uh, we are not fixed with that number ke terabytes petabytes you know we don't know what is the size of the data that is being generated wonderful third question connection to this please please and very wonderful answers from your side okay so man lete hain ki sab log data generate kar rahe hain every day the data is being generated and data is you know in generating in huge numbers like you said we don't know sir unlimited size hai uska pata nahi humko to ye data ja kahan raha hai so third question is where the data is going sab generate kar rahe hain size bahut hai data ka huge size hai we don't know the size of the data so where the data is getting exactly kahan ja raha hai data data is recording server it has been forwarding various servers servers yani you know google has got its own server amazon has got its own server and uh, you know multiple uh, uh, companies have its multiple servers right so data is being stored in the servers correct answer got it now once the data is being stored okay the next question the last question comes to you is how we are going to jaise aapne bola hai use the data how we are going to use the data chalo usko aur easy karta hu question ko everyone has used excel sheet sabko excel sheet aati hai Microsoft. yes sir yes everyone knows yes. ko pata hai ye koi badi baat nahi hai bahut aasan hai right so in that uh, uh, kitne rows and kitne columns se agar aap blank excel sheet open karte ho just just any thought on this if you open a blank excel sheet and uh, if i tell you ke how many rows and columns are there in that blank excel sheet so what what would be your answer whatever we want right just imagine so it goes n number of rows n number of columns for sheets jo open hoti hai excel sheet theek hai now if i tell you if i tell you right if i tell you ke just imagine aapke paas you know 10000 rows or 10000 columns hai aapke excel sheet mein If your Excel sheet has got ten thousand rows and ten thousand columns, and if I tell you, yeah, I want the information to be extracted from that data, so you have an Excel sheet where there are ten thousand rows and ten thousand columns. Just imagine ten thousand rows and ten thousand columns, for the sake of discussion assumption, and I want I want you to extract the data out of it. So extraction in the sense, I can ask you like, what is the relation between first column and second column? or uh, what this uh, data is all about what is the summary of the data is tarah ke questions hai right and i tell you please extract the information out of this data jo aapke paas hai and uh, yeah i just want to hear ke uh, kaise karenge 
10,000 rows, 10,000 columns in Excel sheet, and I'm telling you to extract the information. So what will be your answer? Sir, sorry, question is not clear. Exit button again. Okay, fine. You have an Excel sheet where there is data in Excel sheet. Mein. Okay, I'm just generalizing the statement data. <laughs> And I'm saying your data is comprised in the form of rows and columns, which Excel sheet up open karte ho. Obviously, cells mein hai data. And that, you know, rows and columns are just imagine for the sake of discussion, 10,000 rows hai or 10,000 columns hai aapke paas Excel sheet mein. Okay. Hai? Yes. And I tell you, uh, please extract the information out of that data, out of that sheet. So, what will be your possible answer if I ask you in this way? Sir, we will use some formulas and functions by Excel. Formulas and Okay. Everyone understood the question? What is the question? So much may I guess? Okay. Yes, sir. Wonderful. Yes, sir. Yes. So you apply some uh, formulas, you apply some functions, and you, you know, uh, try to evaluate or try to extract the information out of to it. Finding right? the extract answer uh, answer and information. Sorry, uh, finding you to apply formula to finding a good answer. Right. So start yes. start from arranging the may... yes yes please speak. We may speak sir we may specify cell address so that what exact data we need we we will need we will get it from right. the excel right what you said is hundred percent correct okay and uh, one thing is आप लोगों ने पूछा नहीं अभी just someone said sir what kind of data it is right someone said just now what kind of data it is so question, if I ask you, please info, extract the information out of this data. So the answer would be, okay, sir, first question, aap ye pushenge, sir, what kind of data it is, whether it is a numerical data, statistical mm -hmm. data, or any textual data, mm -hmm. ya consa data, ya image data, first thing. Second, when I say I want to extract the information out of the data, so obviously he said, sir, humko kuch operations karna padenge uske upar, right? Some formula supply karna padega, ya, you know, some logic supply karna padega, so that we get a meaningful information out of the data third we are uh, aware of the size of the data so we know ke, uh, how much space is required to you know store the data so your data science is all about this jo aapne abhi bola na, orally verbally jo bola aapne. Yes, sir, what kind of data operations karna hai, and uh, logic supply karna hai, and uh, all this so if i tell you uh, again uh, jaise so how much time you require for extracting the information? Kitna time lagega? Fir bhi. Just give me a wild guess. 10,000 columns. Sorry? So fractions of seconds. Uh, fraction of seconds may hojain ka 10,000 rows, 10,000 columns may? No. 10,000 rows. Fractures, uh, fractures of minutes. Few minutes. Few minutes? Minutes may hojain ka? Yeah. Sir, our algorithm will depend on how much time you have. Hmm. Sir, it depend. Someone said rightly. Sir, our no, algorithm will depend on how much time you have. Correct. And you said rightly, very right. Okay, whatever the tool al algorithm you are using, it depends on that. The tool you are using, okay, and the tool or algorithm you are implementing, for information extract, it depends on that. Depend so your data science is all about this, analyzing the data. Okay, data collection आ गया. आपके पास data है. Data को analyze कर रहे हैं. आप start कर रहे हैं. What kind of data it is? Now you are going for data science operations. Operations कर रहे हो आप data पे. The tools, algorithms, techniques, formulas, all this you are performing on the data, and then you start you know deriving the results, extracting the information summary. So all these things you are you know doing at your end so that the meaningful information should be taken out from the data. And if you see what all we discussed, we have discussed question answers, queries, interactions, that all is all about your data science. Okay, I'm very much happy that you guys are, you know, totally uh, interacting with me. And it's, you know, the uh, most common definition, if you do Google, you will get this definition aapko, uh, normally. Milega. So study of massive amount of data, huge amount of data, which we discussed ki already. Kis liye? Which involves extracting meaningful information. You are trying to extract something meaningful out of it. And uh, what type of data it is? Just like bola, sir. What uh, kind of data it is? Which is raw data, structured data, unstructured data that we don't know. Data, we are getting. We are working on it. 
okay and that is processed using the methods tools technologies algorithms okay so three parts are being covered huge amount of data meaningful extraction depending on whatever the data you are using and also the tools technologies or you know uh, algorithm that you are trying to implement on that so all this forms your data science okay and do we really need this tools chahiye humko techniques chahiye algorithms chahiye yes 10000 rows 10000 columns ko aapko extract karne ke liye kafi time lag jayega we don't know maybe you know a day maybe more than uh, one day two day three days we don't know so we want the information to be done processing to be done in a very fast way so uh, for that we are using these tools and techniques and obviously uh, uh, data science is all about these four points jaise abhi humne discuss kiya so by default abhi sabko pata lag hi gaya hai analyzing, analyzing the, data, the data modeling the data visualizing the data and understanding the data finally so jo aap you know finally uh, extract karenge meaningful information obviously we will able to understand what you are trying to do fir uske baad then uh, later comes the prediction part jo machine learning ka hai okay moving on and if you are having a very big doubt on this ke sir data science koi separate uh, you know uh, domain hai ya koi research area hai ya ya kya hai exactly data science so so it's all about this it's about you know mathematical it's about statistical it's about research it's about domain it's about computers it's about everything you cannot separate the data from any other field medical field data hai military field data hai it field data hai non it field data hai mathematical statistical research whatever it is all this is a culmination of all the domains and if anyone say data science is only about computer science it is very wrong it's not at all about computer science it's only about the applications on that we are using from the computer science okay it's a culmination of all the you know domains that we are using that we are talking about and research data le lo aap you know military data medical data what covid analysis jo ho raha hai na covid analysis of data let's say you know all the medical data we are taking and we are performing operations and everything on that that's all so all this is happening all this is you know being generated all this is being uh, delivered okay moving on yeah uh, the need for data science so uh, one one question to you here uh, uh, everyone please do listen abhi data science aa gaya revolution ban ke aa gaya sab log use kar rahe implement kar rahe uh, what we had before you know this data science can anyone tell abhi aap ko bola hai 10000 rows and columns mein uh, uh, meaningful information nikalni hai so someone said sir we have to use algorithms tools formulas and everything what was before this isse pehle kya tha files फाइल्स में कलेक्ट कोई भी डाटा है फिर कुछ फाइल्स में कलेक्ट करते थे कोई भी यस ओके एंड वेस्ट ऑफ डाटा यस एंड सी इट इज नथिंग कि इससे पहले क्या था या इसके बाद क्या होगा द सेम प्रोसेस सी एनालाइजिंग द डाटा मॉडलिंग द डाटा विजुअलाइजिंग द डाटा अंडरस्टैंडिंग द डाटा प्रॉब्लम क्या होती थी प्रीवियसली वी डोंट हैव यू नो स्पेसिफिक टूल्स एंड एल्गोरिथम्स फॉर दिस is about the lack of uh, uh, you know resources so we were lack of resources we were lack of expertise uh, we were lack of you know the insights we don't know how to operate on the data might be we are aware ke ha ye sare operations karke jaise aapne bola sir kuch formula dalenge to usme you know relation kya hai data ka malum padega might be a case that formula what we are applying uh, a limited formula it cannot be applied to uh, everywhere on the data jo 10000 rows and columns pe disbursed hai okay there is you know the lack of insight we are having lack of expertise we don't know what exact tool or what exact algorithm we have to use we are never aware about that okay unstructured data tha mostly uh, we don't know the how to structure the data how to clean the data how to process the data humko nahi pata tha okay and data storage is obviously is bola sir huge amount of data we are aware of the size so all these you know uh, drawbacks aap nahi bol sakte all all these are you know the lagging points uh, that were led to the need for data science that led to the evolution of data science jab aap aa gaye hain when you have got every tool every technique every algorithm and what you are able to do decision make kar sakte ho you are able to predict the things you are able to you know discover the patterns can anyone give me a live example of decision making model anyone प्रोडिक्शन का कोई लाइव एग्जांपल दे सकते हो डे टू डे रूटीन में हम जो अभी कर रहे हैं हमको हम यूज भी कर रहे होंगे हमको पता नहीं कि वो डेटा साइंस का एप्लीकेशन है सर आज कितने कोविड केसेस आए हैं आज राइट वी सी द एडवर्टाइजमेंट्स राइट अकॉर्डिंग आवर सर्च हिस्ट्री वंडरफुल 
very very right see decision making abol check your scheduling of the you know flights your routes dekh rahe you know they they are checking the weather forecast whether dekh rahe ke whether the flight is you know operable in this weather or not they are able to decide flight chalani hai nahi chalani hai cancel karni hai reschedule karni hai prediction jaise aapne bola covid data ko leke analysis kar rahe hain fir predict kar rahe hain ke what would be the next variant and what is the you know threat or you know what is the threshold of danger and cause to that and also the pattern discoveries you know uh, have has anyone heard about this twitter pe you know um, i don't know whether you are aware of this uh, i think most of you use twitter twitter use karte hain aap log yes yes sir so yes, sir. you might be heard like ye news pe bhi aaya tha bahut sare internet pe bhi chhaya tha ye news you know one algorithm uh, in twitter wo automatically work kar raha tha uh, they actually deployed that algorithm in the twitter system twitter model mein unhone deploy kiya tha that uh, it has you know removed some 700 plus terrorist related accounts okay so un us algorithm ne that the whatever the tool whatever the algorithm they have used that by itself in a automated way automatically removed 700 plus accounts that it sensed as you know terrorist accounts permanently delete kar diya twitter ne okay basing on again some discovery some patterns from finding some you know things that were background mein bahut sara hoga wo algorithm ke piche jo usne kaam kiya hai that that actually happened you can even google twitter has employed this kind of things so just imagine twitter uh, how much the twitter is being used every day across the world out of that it was successfully able to detect 700 plus accounts mark them as you know uh, uh, terrorist accounts are removed it and deleted it permanently that happened theek hai so this is what is you know the uh, power and the strength and you know the usage of your data science that we are discussing about jo hum day to day use kar rahe we are not even aware ke we are uh, using that theek hai move on and again if you see the figures facts and figures bahut bahut okay and like we discussed okay, every day the you know tens and tens of the data is being generated we are not even aware ke kitna data being generate ho raha hai okay and itna generate ho raha hai to obviously you know man power utna nahi lenge aap bol nahi sakte sir 10000 rows and columns ko mere ko you know extract karna hai information i want to extract the information out of that i need you know pratmesh will not say i need 10 more members rishi will not say i will need 15 more members okay so you cannot depend on you know the man power that will come and do the job for you because it is a time consuming process so what we want is you know as the technology grows we want everything to be automated जो काम एक दिन में हो रहा है हम चाहते हैं एक घंटे में हो जो एक घंटे में हो रहा है हम चाहते हैं यू नो दस मिनट में हो दैट्स व्हाट इज द टेंडेंसी राइट सो अगेन सो व्हाट आर द रीजंस फॉर यू नो द रीजंस फॉर यूजिंग दिस डेटा साइंस इज द सेम थिंग टाइम कंजम्पशन जो हमको दिख रहा है ओके एंड यू कैन सी दैट कन्वर्ट द मैसिव अमाउंट ऑफ डेटा इनटू द मीनिंगफुल इनसाइट्स साइज मैटर नहीं करेगा व्हाटएवर द डेटा जस्ट अप्लाई द टूल्स एल्गोरिथम्स एंड गेट द इंफॉर्मेशन आउट ऑफ दिस ओके and uh, ye to pata hi hai sabko google amazon netflix they are having you know the figures in terms of storage we can't even define the storage space huge amount of data so they are all using data science applications data science algorithms for better experience amazon mein aap aa rahe ho na recommendation systems aa raha hai aap amazon se kuch shop kar rahe ho we will immediately recommend you please shop this so is there any one person sitting behind that and it is telling you like no. it's a recommendation that is working on प्रीवियस हिस्ट्री आपकी देखी जा रही है वो डेटा आपके अकाउंट में सेव हो रहा है एंड उसके ऊपर कोई अलगोरिदम अप्लाई किया जा रहा है यू यू कि प्लीज हैव अ लुक ऑन दिस थिंग्स आल्सो आर शॉपिंग ठीक है सेल्फ ड्राइविंग कार आ चुकी है इट इज ऑलवेज मीन इम्प्लीमेंटेड इन द वेस्ट हो चुका है वी आर नॉट अगेन डिपेंडेंट ऑन यू नो समन टू यू नो लर्न दिंग्स एंड गेट द लाइसेंस एंड डू दिंग्स इज बिंग इम्प्लीमेंटेड सो एंड वॉट नॉट and what not predictions hai you know uh, pattern discoveries hai decision making hai many thing many thing has been uh, what you call generated aap uh, uh, google play store open kar rahe ho hotel book karna hai aapko you know n number of uh, apps milenge again wahan pe recommendation system rahega aapko it will help you out in making the decision flight book karni hai again uh, recommendation system these flights are you know comparable prices batate hain wahan pe it is helping you out ओके प्रीवियसली ये था लेकिन इट वाज नॉट ऑन दिस स्केल वी यूज्ड टू नो लॉग इन टू द साइट चेक दैट अगेन ओपन अनदर साइट चेक दिस फिर कंपेयर टाइम कंजम्पशन यू नो इज बीइंग डन सेव हो गया टाइम हमारा एवरीथिंग इज बीइंग ऑटोमेटिकली डन ओके मूविंग ऑन या कैन कैन एनीवन जस्ट लुक एट दिस एंड टेल मी व्हाट इज द डिफरेंस देन नाउ
anyway just just a simple thought on this it's not i'm not asking you to explain this a uh, very simple thought sir tools okay and and what do you observe what do you observe sir and visual can... difference dik manually and right. our man power right right you can see all this ye wahi operation se jo hum yahan kar rahe hain you know it's all about you know data collection data storage processing the data and you know finally getting the results this is also the same thing we are doing the same thing here we are not doing anything new jo purana kar rahe the operations wahi sare cheeze hum kar rahe but you know like you said when someone has said tools we know about ke abhi kaun sa data structured hai unstructured hai proper data format humko pata hai ya nahi pata you know we know about what technology we are using you know for the data storage we don't know we you know you should store the data in piles and piles algorithms are used kar rahe ho you know tools used kar rahe ho you know to sort out the uh, uh, confusion to sort out the meaningful extraction yeah nahi pata we you know we you, you control flow jo tha humko nahi pata tha and now finally you are coming with up the discoveries you are coming with up the results you are coming with the predictions patterns decision makings yahan bas output aap likh rahe the show kar rahe the so this is actually you know the basic thing between uh, previous and now that we are trying to learn so all these are you know the part of your data science that you are trying to you know uh, observe and learn now and again if you are going to look at the applications and number of applications you have starting from you know like i said in recommendation systems say image and speed gaming hai online price comparison say internet and what not facebook use kar rahe ho you know automatically friend suggestions aa rahe hain is someone sitting behind there and you know asking you or you know sending you the messages to look for the any friends no image and speaker creation say google assistant hai alexa aa gaya hai siri aa gaya hai even what not आप फेसबुक पे कोई फोटो अपलोड कर रहे हो नो इट विल यू नो इमीडिएटली रिकॉग्नाइजेस के ओके दिस फोटो इज रिलेटेड विद दिस काइंड ऑफ आईडी समवन इज यू नो वर्किंग इन द बैकग्राउंड द टूल एंड अल्गोरिथम गेमिंग अब गेमिंग यूज कर रहे हो ओके यू आर यूजिंग योर गेम्स यू आर प्लेइंग योर गेम्स एंड एवरीथिंग इज बीइंग यू नो नाउ अब बोल रहे हो सर रियल रियल टाइम सिनेरियो गेम्स एंड प्ले कर रहे हैं थ्रीडी गेम्स प्ले कर रहे हैं ओके इट्स नॉट एज यू आर जस्ट प्लेइंग द गेम it's about the you know the data that is being stored and the algorithm or tool that is being working in the background and that you are able to say sir real time live experience dikh raha hai humko game khelne mein theek hai online price comparisons ho rahe you know hotels ke flight tickets ke you know online shopping ke and what not all these are you know the uh, day to day hum use kar rahe we even you you know you use amazon daily ab log use kar rahe ho flipkart daily we, we are using You don't know that is an application of your data science. So, algorithm is or tool is working behind that. Okay, and if you say, sir, जब इतना simple है, तो then why it is you know not being implemented everywhere? It is being implemented everywhere, but still we have got some challenges. बहुत सारे challenges हैं. When you say huge amount of data, that itself is a challenge. Okay, and if you look at you know the basic reasons, uh, uh, we are again not limited to these reasons. हम बोलेंगे नहीं कि यही reasons हैं. Uh, uh, we are you know lagging in terms of uh, uh, usage jaise aapne bola kisi ne sir data usage ko data science bolte hain you see if an organization is small they can't have data science team to so, uh, be data matter karega na abhi aapko main bolta hu 10000 rows 10000 columns manually karna hai so yurishikesh will say or you know someone will say pratmesh will say sir i even need four more members to work on this i will give you the output in monday and if i say i don't want 10000 rows 10000 column 100 rows and 100 columns here then you will say obviously sir i can do this in an hour or two that is what next lack of significant domain experts we don't have we we know about the data data is being generated data hai data hai data hai what to do what experts you that work, work on the data obviously the privacy issues security issues you know everyone says that our data is being very secure ओके मेरा डेटा बहुत सिक्योर है मेरा सर्वर बहुत सिक्योर है मेरा सिस्टम इज सो सिक्योर इनफ यू नो नथिंग कैन हैपन देन इट्स इन अ रॉन्ग नोशन एवरी डे ए न्यू थ्रेड कम्स यू नीड टू बी कीप अपडेटिंग योरसेल्फ एंड देयर इज नो टर्म कॉल्ड सिक्योरिटी इन द वर्ल्ड ऑफ आईटी प्लीज मार्क दिस वी बोल रहा है मेरा सिस्टम 100% सिक्योर है देन इट इज अ वेरी फॉल्स स्टेटमेंट इन ऑर्डर टू मेंटेन दैट यू नो सिक्योरिटी लेवल यू हैव टू बी Uh, regularly updated with all the you know latest threats and according to you have to you know take the precautions and measures okay and explaining data science to this is difficult you guys obviously we will say nahi research data hi hai isi pe hum kaam kare isi pe aap application bana ke do
someone says you know work on the military data someone says work on the statistical data so much so when explaining to each and every because application jab aap karoge na iska when you learn the data and send with start application every application differs depending on the data that you are working on aap bol nahi sakte medical data ka application is equivalent to you know the military field data no it is not it will not be you know statistical data is different from textual data textual data is different from image data each and every appli- application differs wahan pe har tool hal algorithm change hota hai that you work on recommendation system twitter ka alag hai recommendation system facebook ka alag hai recommendation system facebook ka alag hai and then it's an amazon it's a different they got all their own you know applications implications on that so that also you know the uh, basic reasons and also the data science not effectively used by the decision makers okay because we are not aware of you know the power of the data science uh, we will not be using this bolenge yaar chodo hum apna karte hain that's that's actually a challenge that's actually a challenge and unavailability of the data data bahut hai but i am unable to access that then what is the use and obviously one one important point management does not provide financial support for the data science team it may happen for xyz reasons we are not into that it may happen okay so not adequate data science talent pool sabko pata hai data science hai but we don't have enough experts and talents in that because it's a, it has got a huge potential huge market huge future perspective okay and if you say sir mereko you know if i learn the data science also mereko properly you know learn karke uh, proper output dena hai predict karna hai discover karna hai then you know aapke paas variety of information or data hona chahiye If you are learning data science, you should know which algorithm to be applied on, you know, data A, which algorithm to be applied on data B, which algorithm to be applied on data C. This kind of distinction, if you have differentiation, you have, then you will be a successful data scientist. And obviously, most of them are. अभी बहुत सारे लोग हैं. You are not a successful data scientist in this. Also, all these are, you know, the challenges of the data science that we are facing, that we will be facing, obviously, as you know, the time progresses. अगर कोई यू नो आर्किटेक्चरल डायग्राम है क्या सर इसका या कोई यू नो ऐसा कुछ है जो हम बता सके यू नो वट इज डेटा कॉम्पोनेट्स ऑफ द डेटा साइंस नहीं जो टूल्स एल्गोरिथम्स आप यूज कर रहे हो ऑल दिस विल बी यू नो अप्लाइड इन दिस काइंड ऑफ थिंग्स ओके सो यू आर यू नो सर्वर्स कम इन टू प्ले यूर यू नो सुपर कंप्यूटर्स मेन फ्रेम कंप्यूटर्स जो भी आप यूज कर रहे हो इवन योर लैपटॉप ऑल्सो इट डज मैटर जहाँ पे आप यू नो एल्गोरिजम लिख रहे हो और उसको रन करके देख रहे हो कि क्या हो रहा है okay so data engineering applying all the operations applying all the methods applying all the techniques jaise aapne simple sa bola tha formula supply kar rahe hain sir sheet mein yes okay and your uh, expertise also your level of expertise your level of understanding also it's uh, again a part of your uh, data science component and what kind of operations what kind of mathematics what kind of statistics you are doing and how you are able to visualize the data data ko kis tarah aap dekh pa rahe ho finally you are coming up with the result covid analysis ka aap you know graph bata rahe ho how it is looking so all these are you know the individual components that form the data science so data science is not simply about the data it's about all these things that you are seeing on the screen okay so ye sab karne ke liye we should have you know the proper knowledge the proper data variety of the data proper you know information about how to process the data how to analyze the data how to clean the data how to you know, make sense out of it ठीक है and this is what is a general data science process please do remember this it's a very you know uh, good thing and that we are going to do so starting from your data preparation jahan se aap data collect karke prepare kar rahe ho the modeling you are planning the model and building the model performing the operations and coming up with the results we example lenge 10000 rows 10000 columns wala aap data aapke paas aa chuka hai prepare ho chuka hai you have collected the data and now you are planning what kind of operations to be performed on the data and finally you are building a model ke 10000 rows 10000 columns mein kaun se kaun se columns mein kya relation hai column a has got relation with column 10th column 10th has got relation with column 11th theek hai and accordingly jaise aapne bola formulas apply kar rahe ho operations kar rahe ho again these kind of things we are doing with the help of again tools and algorithms the specified a machine learning algorithm so that will help out to do so you don't need to you know manually do the things jaise hum c c plus plus mein kar rahe the har cheez dal ke compiler ko bol rahe the please generate the thing we have got machine learning algorithms wonderful machine learning algorithms just 
ट्रांसफर दैट फाइल जो भी आप फाइल ले रहे हो एक्सेल शीट या जो भी डेटा आपके पास है दैट ट्रांसफर दैट फाइल टू दू नो एलगोरिदम द कोड जो आप बना रहे हो एंड सी द रिजल्ट एंड सी द रिजल्ट ओके दैट कंपाइलर दैट एलगोरिदम विल बी जनरेटिंग वॉट एग्जैक्टली यूर ट्राइंग टू फिगर आउट ठीक है so that is what is a basic data science process and now the question comes i think most of you are still worrying and thinking ki sir uh, what kind of tools are available kaun se tools hai jo humko seekhna padega kaun se you know techniques hai kaun se methods hai you can see a number of tools and not limited to this you can go with uh, statistical programming r python abhi most widely used hai and python doesn't honestly require any computer background knowledge anyone can learn this and apart from this sas jupiter r studio and matlab in many tools and like i said you must be aware of which tool to be employed on what kind of data bahut sare tools hai jab google karenge aapko pata lagega bahut sare tools hai okay so it actually depends on the project on the you know the type of data that you are working on okay and if you ask again sir itne sare hai main kaun se seekhu because normally the students pose this question the aspirants pose this question so as of now you know uh, agar aap pooch hi rahe hain so you know in terms of market demand and everything are programming python and uh, tableau jo bahut chal rahe hain and obviously uh, azure my, my, my machine learning studio bhi hai so r studio python and your tableau and hadoop these are you know the most vigorously and rigorously you know used the tools and technologies as of now jo market demand abhi chal raha hai and uh, again it will carry on for 10 or 20 years more ओके इट डजेंट मीन के दूसरे नहीं है ओबियसली ईच एंड एवरी टूल हैज गॉट इट्स ओन इम्पोर्टेंस अकॉर्डिंग टू द डेटा दैट वी आर ट्राइंग टू वर्क आउट बट ऑल दीज टूल्स आर यू नो बेसिकली नीडेड इन ऑर्डर टू बी बेटर डेटा साइंटिस्ट ठीक है वी शुड हैव यू नो द नॉलेज ऑफ ऑल दीज टूल्स एंड वी शुड एटलीस्ट बी एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड के डेटा आपके सामने प्रेजेंट किया गया है विच टूल टू बी यूज विच एलगोरिदम टू बी यूज आपको पता होना चाहिए ठीक है एंड इफ यू सी कि बेसिकली कौन से एल्गोरिथम थे लाइक एसेट मशीन लर्निंग एल्गोरिथम बहुत सारे हैं दीज आर अगेन द बेसिक यू नो द मशीन लर्निंग एल्गोरिथम्स अगेन बेसिक नॉट इन द सेंस कि यही यूज होंगे दीज आर द मोस्ट वाइडली यूज सपोज सपोज वेक्टर मशीन लॉजिस्टिक रिग्रेशन लीनियर रिग्रेशन कॉम्पोनेट एनालिसिस डिसीशन ट्रीज क्लस्टरिंग बहुत सारे बिकॉज नॉर्मली जो डेटा हम प्रेजेंट करते हैं ना समवेयर और अदर द डेटा फॉल्स इन दीज काइंड ऑफ कैटेगरीज तो ये एल्गोरिथम्स बहुत वाइडली यूज होते हैं डेटा साइंस में जो आपको बता पाएंगे जो यू नो दैट विल डू द वर्क फॉर यू ओके सो ए डेटा साइंटिस्ट हैव द नॉलेज ऑफ ऑल दिस थिंग्स मूविंग ऑन आई थिंक किस किस ने यू नो मिनी प्रोजेक्ट या मेजर प्रोजेक्ट किया है इस पर किसी को आइडिया है यू नो लिस्ट ऑफ टेन प्रोजेक्ट दैट यू आर सींग एनी वन हैज डन एनी थिंग ऑन दिस या यूज दिस वंस किसी ने किया है no sir no you know no, sometimes sir. you you open a website kai koi website aap open kar rahe ho aur immediately left side ya right side aapko ek chatbot aata hai correct may i help you sir yes okay. sir and you start communicating with the chatbot thinking ke koi humse chat kar raha hai honestly it's a you know a recommendation system jahan kaam kar raha hai it's a natural language processing system that is working for you it will ask may i help you what you are looking for What is your information? Your mail ID, your contact, सब वो पूछ रहा है हम उसको दे रहे हैं. Okay, and these are not you know the major kind of things that अभी तक develop हुए. These are the you know best best or simple you know projects that have been developed. I think uh, somewhere or other you might have seen fake news detection, कैसे detect कर सकते हैं. You know cancer detections and you know web traffic forecasting कैसे हो रहा है. Google Maps में आप देख रहे हो. You know if you are searching for location, navigation सब डाल रहे हो. तो टू 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 रूट दिखाएगा एक रूट दिखाएगा रेड कलर मार्क सीन दैट एक रूट दिखाएगा ब्लू कलर मार्क व्हाट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन दैट गूगल मैप में अगर सर रेड में रेड में ट्रैफिक बहुत ज्यादा रहता है करेक्ट वी वी आर सेइंग ट्रैफिक बहुत ज्यादा है बट गूगल को कैसे पता चल रहा है है ना सो सैटेलाइट इज वाचिंग या क्या हो रहा है और वो यू नो फ्रैक्शन ऑफ सेकंड्स पे अपडेट होते रहता है डेटा उतना फास्ट है तो उसका एल्गोरिदम कितना फास्ट है उसका टूल कितना फास्ट है जो सर्वर एंड पे आपको यू नो फ्रैक्शन ऑफ सेकंड्स में दिखा रहा है नो डोंट फॉलो दिस पाथ प्लीज गो इन दिस वे यहाँ पे ट्रैफिक बहुत है टाइम ज्यादा लगेगा ओके एंड स्पीच रिकॉग्निशन सिस्टम ये तो पासवर्ड है बहुत सारे कंपनी आई थिंक इवन इन योर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन इट माइट बी यूजिंग सम रिकॉग्निशन हो रहे हैं 
Okay, so everything, everything is being, you know, implemented in terms of data science applications. We never know, but I'm used to it. Okay, so moving on. The most important part of the last part of this, you know, webinar. Okay, uh, what are the career opportunities? Sir, if I'm data science, I'm learning or I'm learning. You know, once you are a graduate, obviously you have to spend time. I honestly, say you have to spend time in learning this, because obviously students and parents' का question ही है सर हम हमारे लड़के को या लड़की को data science सिखाएंगे. Then what is the future? क्या packages रहेंगे? Salary कहाँ मिलेगी? कौन सी company में मिलेगी? Okay, कहाँ से शुरू करना है? कहाँ खत्म करना है? You know? can see the list you can be a data scientist you can be a data analyst you can be a data architect data engineer and what not so uske liye aapko you know these kind of things you must be aware of okay and it's a you know time consuming process obviously time lagega na aapko seekhne i cannot say ke python aap ek din mein seekhoge if anyone is saying it's a very you know blunder you cannot learn r programming in 3 days you have to spend time to be a data scientist You know, you have to spend time to be a, a data engineer. You have to spend time to be a data analyst. Okay, so these kind of you know technologies, you can say, na tools, you can say, technology, you can say, ये हमको आना चाहिए जो data science का part है. So when you start learning this data science, you will understand what is Python and how it is being implemented. What is a machine learning algorithm? Data आपको दिया गया है, तो उसपे काम कैसे किया जाए? Excel sheet आपको दे रहा हूँ मैं, और मैं बोल रहा हूँ, I want the information out of that. So कौन सा algorithm लगाना है और output कैसे दिखाना है, आपको आना चाहिए. That's what is all your data science about. ये data science आपको सिखाएगा and once you are able to you know do that on n number of levels, then you will be you know labeled as a data analyst or data administrator. And अगर आप बोले सर हम ये कर भी लेते हैं ना once we are done with this, if we achieve this also, then what is the you know scope? Salary matter करेगी, right? And then you can see this is you know the general statistics that is being derived across the world, not only in India, across the world ये statistics है. Because अभी work from home चल रहा है. Even is you know pandemic here, so how? So if you got you know less experience, also the starting package will be four lakhs. This is general you know discussion scenario that I am saying. Not exactly. It is more than that. One to four years, your package goes to more than seven lakhs, and uh, you know five to nine years, one million, and you know ten to nineteen years and two millions. But the condition is you have to you know get into this. Ye 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 zone me. आपको आने के लिए you have to spend time in learning this. Unless until you get on with this, you will not understand what is what. अगर कोई बोल रहा है data science आपको you know दो महीने में सिखा देंगे तीन महीने में सिखा देंगे then it's it's a wrong thing minimum you know six months one year time it takes to understand the depth of the data science to become a, you know efficient uh, person on that so that you can face the interview. So six months and one year is a good time that you can you know spend on this and acquire a very good job. Starting from four lakhs, it can be you know five, six, seven, eight. We don't know that exactly the package that companies are offering according to the requirement. Okay, so uh, this you know data science school has got huge perspective in the coming because again machine NASA has announced already NASA has announced. Kar diya hai. I think most of you are aware of this. In the coming fifty years, machine learning and data science will be ruling this world. Robots are here, you know, Sophie robots and everything. So data is being processed. So her company, her big company, abhi you know they are starting using this data science algorithms, machine learning, all sub implement kar rahe usme. They want that everything should be fast and accurate. They don't want to waste much of the time, you know, in analyzing the things. Okay, that's the future perspective of this. So uh, I think the time is also you know about to end in five or ten minutes. So we'll uh, get this for discussion part. So any questions you have, guys, please do ask. So we got uh, seven minutes more. Uh, you can pose some questions, your queries with regard to the you know application part or projects part or job or career part. Please do ask. Sir, explain about the uh, big data analytics. Big data analytics. Yes, you want big data analytics, or in that you want only the Hadoop part? No, sir. All the technologies for that. Yeah, you you just want to learn about all the technologies. What uh, is being you know exactly that uh, discussion part in this? Yes, you know sir. what is big data? Yes, so sir. Yeah. Handling about the like uh, right. text. No, why it is called big data? Why it is called big data? The data we can say. Can data analytics we can say. You know. 
डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ डेटा लाइक इमेजेस टेक्सट वो वो वॉल्यूम वेराइटी एंड वेलोसिटी वॉल्यूम इन देंस दाइज वेराइटी इन देंस जैसे आपने बोला different types of data and velocity is you know the speed with which it calculates so this thing is being employed in that analytics technique that is what is your big data uske liye you know storage ke liye hadoop use karte hain bahut sare sab sab technologies aate hain yes sir okay so this 3 bis actually stands for your big data so 3 bis mein aap kya kar rahe ho volume se deal kar rahe ho yani size you are dealing with the velocity the speed you are dealing with the variety the different types of data so this is actually the technology that is being employed for three different dimensions okay and iske liye again hadoop and you know spark hai bahut sare you know pig hai bahut sare technologies hai jo usko help karenge aapko ye achieve karne ke liye uh, sir max is very important for that sorry math subject ha obviously no see baat aisi ho rahi hai na jab aap data ki baat kar rahe ho aur jaise aapne khud bola hai agar 10000 rows columns hai to sabne bola hai sir hum kuch operations karenge kuch formulas dalenge मैथ इसलिए इम्पोर्टेंट नहीं है बिकॉज आपको आना ही चाहिए मैथ इज अ बेसिक यू नो फॉर एवरी स्कूल ग्रेजुएट हम स्कूल में सीखते हैं मैथ्स कॉलेज में सीखते हैं ऑल दिस यू नो द बेसिक पार्ट दो आता है आपके एप्लीकेशन पे एल्गोरिदम्स भी आप यूज कर रहे हो कोई फॉर्मूला डाल रहे हो दोनों मैथ चाहिए उसके लिए ये सो लो कोई इक्वेशन आप डिराइव कर रहे हो ना यू आर डिराइविंग टू यू आर कमिंग टू समी कैलकुलेशन और एनी वैल्यूएशन पार्ट ऑफ दैट मैथमेटिकल एप्लीकेशन तो आ ही जाएगा अभी तो बहुत सारा डेटा स्टैटिस्टिकल है तो स्टैटिस्टिकल डेटा यानी प्योरली और मैथ्स रिलेटेड डेटा ओनली हमको आना चाहिए ना अब मैं बोलता हूं टेंशन फ्रॉम रोन्स है यार प्लीज फाइंड आउट द मेन मीडियन मोड ऑब्वियसली वी शुड नो अबाउट मेन मीडियन मोड हाउ टू कैलकुलेट यस सर तो मैथ्स आ ही रहा है वहां पे सो इट्स नॉट नेसेसरीली कि मैथ्स आना ही चाहिए बट यू नो मैथ्स इज द अंडरलाइंग मैकेनिज्म इन दैट हम बोल नहीं सकते उसको सेपरेट नहीं कर सकते सर डेटा साइंस के लिए कौन-कौन सी लैंग्वेज इंपॉर्टेंट है मतलब As of now, अगर आप पूछे यू नो अभी मार्केट में जो डिमांड चल रहा है जैसे तो मैं बोला हूँ बहुत सारे टूल्स एंड टेक्निक्स अवेलेबल है आर प्रोग्रामिंग इज वाइडली बींग यूज सबसे ज्यादा लाइम लाइट में है पाइथन ठीक है एंड उसके बाद है यू नो आपका टैबलो फिर माइक्रोसॉफ्ट अजूर का भी चल रहा है ये बहुत वाइडली यूज हो रहा है कंपनीज इसको एम्प्लॉय कर रहे हैं बिकॉज दे आर गिविंग द बेटर रिजल्ट आई एम नॉट सेंग अबाउट अदर्स अदर्स भी आए इट डिपेंड्स ऑन द एप्लीकेशन एंड प्रोजेक्ट आर प्रोग्रामिंग पाइथन एंड यू नो this part uh, what we call tableau ye bahut zyada use ho rahe and even uh, in our syllabus in our cloud and data science jo bhi hamare paas hai usme python already humne include kar diya hai and some part of the r also so it is being included in there yes sir sir python hello yeah yeah please सर uh, हमने देखा है कि पाइथन ऐसा किसी एक एक ही डोमेन में से यानी कि सेटिस्फाई करती मतलब जैसा कि अगर पाइथन देखा जाए तो ज्यादा एम एल और ए आई में ज्यादा यूज होती है mm-hmm. तो बाकी एरिया में भी हो सकती है Yes, Python is not uh, specifically made for machine learning or data science. Machine learning, data science application of Python में कर सकती हूँ. देखो simple सा logic है. मैं बहुत simple तरीके से आपको बताऊँगा. Uh, C language सबने पढ़ा है. सबको आता है C language? Yes sir. Okay. Yes sir. If I if I want to print hello world, मेरे को कितने lines लिखने पड़ेंगे C में? One. Five to six. Five to six. You know, आपका main uh, uh, header file, फिर main method. then open the brace right print of then get ch and close the brace so five to six lines ho gaye yes sir the same thing if i want to you know implement in python i'll just say print hello world yes sir i don't require any method i don't require any file i don't require any brace i don't require any semicolon nothing and yahi single statement aap school uh, kid ko batayenge if you show this single statement print hello world aur aap bolenge school kid ko yaar i know maine python seekh liya hai to wo bolega kahan seekha hai this is just an english statement सुन वो बताएगा आपको ये ये तो सिंपल सा इंग्लिश स्टेटमेंट है आपको आपने कौन सा तीन बार लिया है ना ऑनेस्टली इट इज करेक्ट यू नो बिकॉज पाइथन इज मेड इन सच अ सिंपल एंड इजी अंडरस्टैंडेबल लैंग्वेज उसके एप्लीकेशन हम सारे यूज कर रहे हैं जैसे डेटा साइंस और मशीन लर्निंग में सो इट इज बींग वाइडली यूज लाइम लाइट में उसी रीजन से आ रहा है ऐसा नहीं कि पैथन एक ही यू नो मशीन लर्निंग डेटा साइंस के लिए बना है नहीं पैथन में भी बहुत सारे पाइचाम है आपको यू नो जुपिटर है स्पाइडर है एंड वॉट नॉट बहुत सारे टू कॉल डेवलपमेंट एनवायरनमेंट से जहां पे आप पैथन से काम कर सकते हो बहुत सारे प्रोग्रामिंग पे यस yes, सर पर अभी देखा जाता है कि जावा पर सबसे ज्यादा काम हो रहा है अभी भी मतलब यस ऑफ कोर्स बहुत सारा यू नो द पावर ऑफ पैथन इज यू नो वाइडली बीइंग स्प्रेड इट्स नॉट लाइक ए जावा से नहीं हो रहा है इन टर्म्स ऑफ एप्लीकेबिलिटी एंड इन टर्म्स ऑफ यूसेज एंड इन टर्म्स ऑफ लर्निंग पैथन इज मच इजीयर कंपेयर टू एनी अदर प्रोग्रामिंग 
yes, उस वजह से पैथन लाइम में आया है ठीक है गॉट इट एक्सक्यूज मी सर यस प्लीज सर करेंटली आई एम परसुइंग माई बी एस सी यस सर आई बट आई वॉन्ट टू डेटा साइंस एज माई करियर सो और शुड बी माई फर्दर स्टेप्स इन दिस डायरेक्शन एंड इफ यू आर ऑनेस्टली सीरियस अबाउट योर गुड नेम सॉरी सर ऋषिकेश ऋषि इफ यू आर सीरियसली अबाउट यू नो परसुइंग डेटा साइंस और मशीन लर्निंग मैं ऑनेस्टली रिकमेंड करूंगा आपको प्लीज एनरोल फॉर डेटा साइंस फ्रॉम ए वेल रेप्यूड ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ओके जो यू नो आपको सिक्स मंथ्स वन ईयर में आपको डेटा साइंटिस्ट का यू नो टैग दे सके एटलीस्ट यू नो वेन यू फेस द इंटरव्यू यू शुड बी एबल टू क्रैक दैट इंटरव्यू इन टर्म्स ऑफ डेटा साइंस ओके एंड इफ यू आर लर्निंग फॉर वन मंथ और टू मंथ्स कहीं आई एम अगेन नॉट ब्लेमिंग एनी टेक्निकल बिकॉज मेरे को किसी से कुछ है नहीं कोई इंस्टीट्यूट्स वगैरह में आपको एक दो महीने में सिखा रहे तो देन दैट विल नॉट डू द जॉब फॉर यू तो मिनिमम यू नो सिक्स एंड मैक्सिमम वन ईयर कोर्स यू हैव टू एनरोल पुट योर टाइम ऑन दिस आप अपना टाइम दीजिए देन यू कैन कम अप विद कलरफुल वर्ल्ड ठीक है सो यूर रिजल्ट विल बी मच मोर बेटर बट यू शुड अंडरस्टैंड अगर आप बहुत सीरियस हो उस बारे में देन प्लीज एनरोल फॉर दिस एंड गेट ऑन विद दिस ठीक है यस सर थैंक यू सर थैंक यू सो मच एनी मोर एल्स गाइस आर वी डन फॉर फॉर एक्सप्लेन मी ऑन जॉब या सॉरी प्लीज कम अगेन एक्सप्लेन मी ऑन जॉब कैरियर जॉब के बारे में बताऊं यस यस अगर आप यू नो जस्ट एग्जांपल जैसे अभी ऋषि ने पूछा है सर मैं वन ईयर का अगर कोर्स कर लेता हूं तो मैं ये नो एलिजिबल हो जाऊंगा डेटा साइंटिस्ट के लिए नहीं वन ईयर के कोर्स में डेटा साइंटिस्ट नहीं बनेंगे वन ईयर्स के कोर्स में आप यू नो यू विल बी एलिबल टू क्रैक एनी डेटा साइंस पोजीशन कोई भी कंपनी में जहां पे रिक्वायरमेंट है एंड वंस यू स्टार्ट वर्किंग ऑन दैट पोजीशन जैसे आपने कंपनी में एक दो साल बिता लिए एंड वंस यू वर्क विद एन नंबर ऑफ प्रोजेक्ट्स देन द कंपनी लेबल कंपनी खुद आपको लेबल करेगी यू आर ए सर्टिफाइड डेटा साइंटिस्ट सर्टिफाइड डेटा इंजीनियर ओके हां अगर आप यू नो द बिग एमएनसीस में जहां जाके आप डेटा साइंस कोर्स कर रहे हो एंड यू आर कमिंग अप विद दैट वो सर्टिफाई करेंगे बट अनलेस अंटिल यू आर वर्क शोस दैट विल नॉट बी वैलिडेटेड ओके सो लर्निंग इज डिफरेंट पार्ट एप्लीकेशन इज डिफरेंट पार्ट सो फर्स्ट वी लर्न टू क्रैक द इंटरव्यू जब आपको जॉब मिलेगा देन यू विल बी यू नो गोइंग टू द नेक्स्ट हायर लेवल्स एंड अकॉर्डिंगली जैसे मिनिमम पैकेज मैंने बोला इट्स नॉट नेसेसरीली के वही हो इट स्टार्ट्स फ्रॉम 4 5 लाख एंड इट गोस बियॉन्ड दैट depending on your capability and potential and expertise jis tarah aapne seekha hai theek hai and pandemic hai to bahut sare opportunities abhi hai is nahi ke nahi hai bahut is online hai work from home hai us based company sara work from home de rahi hai so a huge potential is there in the it market and it industry side yes any more is guys sir uh, when you were talking about uh, ki uh, amazon jaisi companies uh, recommendation deti hai I am trying to run one code. एक कोड में लिख रहा हूँ ठीक है वेरी सिंपल लैंग्वेज में आपको बताऊंगा एवरीवन अंडरस्टैंड मैं कोड लिख रहा हूँ एंड आई एम रनिंग दैट कोड ओके एंड आई एम एक्सपेक्टिंग दैट कोड टू गिव मी द रिजल्ट दैट हैज बीन प्रिडिक्टेड प्लीज लिजन केयरफुल आई एम ट्राइंग टू रन वन कोड एक कोड लिख के मैं रन कर रहा हूँ एंड आई एम एक्सपेक्टिंग दैट कोड टू गिव मी वन रिजल्ट वॉट आई एम ट्राइंग टू प्रिडिक्ट तो वो हो गया है आपका मशीन लर्निंग मशीन इज ट्राइंग टू लर्न फ्रॉम द कोड उसका एग्जांपल देते हैं चेस गेम खेला है आपने कंप्यूटर के साथ यस यस सर ओके ओके सो वो आपका मशीन लर्निंग का सिंपल सा एप्लीकेशन है तो वो कोड काफी बार रन हो चुका है मे बी हंड्रेड टाइम्स थाउजेंड टाइम्स वो कोड इतना यू नो इफेक्टिव बन गया है जैसे आप चेस खेल रहे हो जैसे आप मूव कर रहे हो वेन यू आर मूविंग यू नो दॉन्स आर वट एवर दिंग्स दैट यू आर डूइंग ऑन द चेस बोर्ड Accordingly, आपको काउंटर आ रहा है कंप्यूटर की तरफ से यू नो द कंप्यूटर इज सो प्रोफिशियंट एफिशियंट इनफ टू काउंटर यूर मूव इट मीन्स दैट जो अलगोरदम जो कोड वो बैकग्राउंड में चल रहा है वो काफी बार रन हो चुका है एंड द मशीन हैज लर्न वेरी इफेक्टिवली टू काउंटर एनी मूव दैट हैज बीन डन बाई द यूजर और मूव जो भी है सामने ठीक है ये मशीन लर्न कर चुका है यानी सीख चुका है ठीक है सीखने के लिए यू नो वो सीख चुका है दैट इज अ मशीन लर्निंग एप्लीकेशन कैसे सीखा है 
मैं कोड बनाया हूँ मैं बोलता हूँ एक स्टेप आगे लेते हैं फिर दो स्टेप आगे लेते हैं फिर क्राउंटर क्रॉस में उसको यू नो किल करते हैं इन ऑर्डर टू डू दिस आई हैव टू यू नो मेक सम पैटर्न मेक सम डिस्कवरीज मेक सम लॉजिक्स ऑन टू दैट कोड सो दैट इज वॉट इज यूर आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस यू आर ट्राइंग टू मेक द मशीन थिंक इन एन आर्टिफिशियल वे ऑब्वियसली वो ह्यूमन इंटेलिजेंस ही है यू के नॉट से वो ह्यूमन इंटेलिजेंस है बट यू आर trying to make that machine think in an artificial way very challenging now come to your question agar aap bol rahe hain sir recommendation system jo amazon mein hai wo artificial intelligence ka hai no it is not your main simple sa aur ek tarike se bolunga machine learning artificial intelligence ka you know the latter part of the application part aapka machine learning hai machine learning ka application part aapka recommendation system hai. are you getting making the computers think in an artificial way is artificial intelligence making the computers work intelligently is your machine learning and uska application hai aapka recommendation system getting yes sir okay so ye bahut alag hai because mostly jaise aapne pucha bahut acha sawal kiya aapne bahut sare log confuse sir ai aur ml to ek hi hai nahi honestly nahi ai ka you know application part aata hai aapka machine learning AI is all about you know theories that will make you that will make your machine to think in an intelligent way. फिर उसका application part है आपका machine learning. The machine has already learned. Now it is applying all those rules that you are taught in the uh, AI model. ठीक है. Clear है और कोई doubt है? No sir. Thank you. Okay. Thank you sir. Fine sir. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you Dr. Arshad uh, Sharif sir for sharing your views. With the participant. Yes, so, yes, yes. If sir has nicely enlightened the participants' need of science, its uh, applications and challenges, data science processes, process uh, tools, algorithms, projects, data science career and market opportunities. Very interactive session, sir. Thank you again very much, sir. Now, second eminent resource person of this webinar is a. Uh, respected mr anil tatore sir he is a training officer department of robotics and cloud technologies rashtra sant tukdu ji maharaj nagpur institute nagpur he has 14 plus years rich industrial experience he has worked with fox solution in international business unit on siemens platform he trained over 2000 students He has delivered expert session in many engineering and science colleges across India. He has counselled more than ten thousand graduate students. He has handled many recruitment drives. He is expertise in cloud technologies, IoT, data science, public speaking, career counselling, and training and placement. Now I request Mr. Anil Tatore sir to enlighten the students. Please sir. thank you sir <clears throat> thank you so much <clears throat> actually uh, honestly speaking uh, i do not have much to explain now because uh, uh, i have seen uh, arshad sir have explained uh, most of the aspect uh, whether it is career related whether it is technology related and uh, uh, whether it is uh, job related so he has covered almost all the aspect what i was supposed to you know discuss post uh, this webinar but then still i i would have a uh, 5 uh, 10 minutes interaction with the students uh, through my own thoughts uh, uh, which i uh, uh, got to uh, learn from my own experience getting it so let's get start so uh, on behalf of nagpur university's uh, cloud and uh, data science department i would like to welcome all the uh, staff members and uh, dear students and uh, my colleagues i would uh, take this opportunity to extend uh, my gratitude to my uh, dear colleague uh, dr arshad sarif uh, for uh, explaining his uh, uh, session very nicely and for making it very simple for the students so uh, students as uh, we all know uh, it's a era of technology where the uh, uh, industries are uh, you know getting transformed Uh, you know right from their conventional resources to a very advanced uh, tools and resources 
so it's a uh, it's a time uh, it's a era when every industry whether it is it non it whether it is small enterprise or a big enterprise uh, uh, whether it is uh, uh, roadside vendor or uh, whether it is well established uh, shop everyone uh, uh, is uh, uh, you know using technology nowadays uh, uh, for that a day to day example is our uh, payment uh, applications right so the payment applications like phone pay paytm or uh, uh, google pay you will see this uh, payment application everywhere uh, right from roadside vendor to a uh, 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 well established uh, shopping malls uh, and a well branded uh, single window shops right everywhere this technology is getting used so this is the reason uh, industry and uh, uh, you know uh, this is the reason uh, the industries are growing like anything and they are uh, uh, more into in a new technologies they are more into in a new tools new techniques but unfortunately the students who are studying their uh, you know conventional courses like bsc or bcca or bca or uh, bsc in it Uh, they all are studying what their super senior or maybe uh, super senior super seniors might have uh, studied so we didn't see a much uh, uh, development in our syllabus and curriculum uh, as far as our indian universities are concerned we didn't see uh, uh, that the universities are uh, bringing industry interface in the pro courses or uh, bringing a, a new edge aspect in the courses that's really very unfortunate they might be having their own challenges we will not get into it uh, uh, we are not going to blame any university or any uh, uh, you know syllabus and curriculum but uh, uh, out there in the uh, other part of the world there are so many options for our youngsters for the students uh, through which they can explore the new technologies they can learn the new technologies and they can get a new age career option in a new age industries that's uh, you know that's my thought and as we all know uh, there are certain concerns of the students you know when uh, when i come across uh, many inquiries or when i come across many students uh, when they uh, you know ask me a question i have i have studied there are some certain common concerns of the students uh, when we interact with them right so out of that concerns i have just made my own points uh, for example uh, when we speak to a freshers jab hum freshers se baat karte hain to freshers ka ek rona hamesha samne aata hai uh, ya fir unka concern bol sakte hai unka pain point hai unka pain point ye hai ki sir we are not able to get the jobs right after graduation hum graduation karte hain itni mehnat karte hain hamare parents itna paisa lagate hain wo humse bahut zyada ummeed karte hain lekin graduation hone ke baad हमें वैसे ही भटकना पड़ता है जैसा एक ट्वेल्थ ड्रॉप आउट स्टूडेंट या स्कूल ड्रॉप आउट स्टूडेंट है जो काम के लिए भटकता है तो ये उनका बहुत बड़ा पेन पॉइंट है ग्रेजुएट uh, स्टूडेंट्स को राइट आफ्टर ग्रेजुएशन जॉब्स नहीं मिलते हैं दूसरा अगर वो जॉब के लिए कहीं वॉक इन जाते हैं कहीं इंटरव्यू के लिए जाते हैं तो इंडस्ट्रीज उनको हमेशा एक्सपीरियंस मांगती है तो इसमें स्टूडेंट का सीधा साफ स्ट्रेट अवे थॉट ये होता है कि सर अगर हमें कोई जॉब ही नहीं देगा तो हमें एक्सपीरियंस मिलेगा और अगर हमारे पास एक्सपीरियंस नहीं है तो हमें जॉब नहीं आ, मिलेगा तो इट्स इट्स लाइक अ वेरी फनी दैट वन वे वी आर सेइंग दी इंडस्ट्रीज आर डिमांडिंग एक्सपीरियंस जी एंड दी अदर वे वी आर सेइंग दैट इफ नो बडी गिव द जॉब हाउ कैन वी गेट द एक्सपीरियंस ये दूसरा uh, बच्चों का कंसर्न होता है तीसरा कंसर्न बच्चों का ये होता है कि सर अगर जॉब मिल भी जाए तो वो टेक्निकल लाइन में हमें जॉब्स नहीं मिलते हम तो या तो सेल्स या तो मार्केटिंग या इंश्योरेंस बेचने वाला जॉब या सिम कार्ड बेचने वाला जॉब ऐसे कुछ कॉमन जॉब्स हमें मिलते हैं जो जॉब्स हम करना नहीं चाहते क्योंकि हम लोग बीएससी बी या बीटेक बैकग्राउंड के हैं तो वी विल ऑलवेज एक्सपेक्ट कि हमें टेक्निकल जॉब्स मिले राइट right? तो ये बच्चों के कुछ कंसर्न हो रहे तो वट आई वुड बी यू नो पुटिंग ऑन दिस और वट माई वर्ड विल बी देयर ऑन दिस इज yes that is very true that the industries are demanding for the uh, well experienced uh, or well trained uh, candidates that is true uh, but uh, are we are we in a position to blame the industries that why they are demanding only experienced candidates or why we are not uh, given opportunities from the industries 
इसके ऊपर मैं बच्चों को स्टूडेंट को यह सवाल पूछना चाहूंगा कि अगर आप एक बिजनेस में हो इफ यू आर द वेदर यू आर अ स्मॉल एंटरप्राइज और वेदर यू आर वेल इस्टेब्लिश बिग एंटरप्राइज अगर आप एक किसी एक स्टार्टअप के साथ चल रहे हैं तो क्या आप नहीं चाहेंगे कि आपके बिजनेस प्रोसेस को या बिजनेस ऑपरेशन को हैंडल करने के लिए वेल एक्सपीरियंस कैंडिडेट्स चाहिए है क्या आप नहीं चाहेंगे स्टूडेंट्स मैं आपको पूछना चाहूंगा यस सर यस दैट्स ट्रू राइट अब मुझे बताइए कि आपको आपके बिजनेस ऑपरेशंस को रन करने के लिए चलाने के लिए व्हाई डू वी नीड व्हाई डू यू नीड एक्सपीरियंस कैंडिडेट व्हाई कैंट टू गो विद द फ्रेश इंजीनियर या फ्रेश ग्रेजुएट के साथ आप क्यों नहीं जाना चाहेंगे उसको हायर क्यों नहीं करना चाहेंगे वी डोंट वॉन्ट एनी प्रॉब्लम टेल मी द क्रक्स ऑफ दिस एंटायर थिंग एक्सपीरियंस डायरेक्टिंगा to teach them everything and if someone is experienced they know how the things work and how it can and it's also beneficial for the company or the startup and it will not require more of the energy to be put in brilliant brilliant samruddhi excellent so that's the point you know yes uh, what other said uh, it is also correct that uh, you know the freshers are don't uh, having uh, that much knowledge or uh, you know uh, the experienced guy will work very efficiently and their business operations of that particular company will be uh, you know run very efficiently that's very true uh, so uh, uh, as we all are agree with this so it is very necessary for us to understand that the industries are also having a cutthroat competition in a market right if suppose me if i have my own startup where i have uh, you know i have invested maybe uh, millions right so what is my purpose of investing millions in my business my purpose is very clear i i just want the best roi right that is nothing but return of investment so whatever i am investing in my business i am expecting return out of it and the return will come only when uh, you know i'll make my customers happy i'll i'll give a business, i'll give business, best services to my customers i'll give best services to my clients right so when it comes to a services or when it comes to a product delivery or when it comes to uh, you know any kind of business operation it will need business expertise it will need uh, you know the tools knowledge technologies knowledge what i am using uh, to make my business very efficient and it's happening uh, everywhere you know as i told you right from a roadside vendor to a big size enterprises everybody is are using advanced tools uh, they are using advanced technologies to make their business more efficient Getting it? पहले ये होता था कि एक रोड साइड वेंडर हमें एक रुपया दो रुपया चिल्लर के लिए यू नो रिजेक्ट कर देता था कि सर आप चिल्लर दीजिए खुला दीजिए मेरे पास चिल्लर नहीं है आज एक रोड साइड वेंडर के पास फोन पे पेटीएम है राइट right? और आई एम आई एम नॉट श्योर इट इज अ वेरी रेलिवेंट यू नो एग्जाम्पल बट इट इज जस्ट टू मेक यू अंडरस्टैंड आई एम गिविंग यू दिस एग्जाम्पल नाउ Uh, the paytm and the phone pay and the google pay these kind of companies or the companies who are developing these applications needs the people who can work on a development of such applications where data science is applied where artificial intelligence is applied where machine learning is applied where the uh, cloud technology is uh, you know getting uh, uh, getting action in uh, or getting into in picture right so this kind of applications are getting produced are created uh, you know daily basis millions of uh, such applications and uh, softwares and uh, you know uh, tools are getting developed daily basis and the companies who are developing this kind of tools and techniques and applications need a huge amount of manpower you know who can work for them who can give them the best delivery of product or best delivery of particular application or best delivery of particular 
software development, right? So it is very, very important that you, uh, to have an experience to work on that particular, uh, you know, tools and uh, technologies. If you are not having experience, अभी बच्चों का ये भी होता है कि सर फ्रेशर को एक्सपीरियंस तो नहीं रहेगा दैट इज ट्रू सो डू यू नो वट इज द बेस्ट अल्टरनेटिव ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस आपके हिसाब से एक्सपीरियंस का बेस्ट अल्टरनेटिव क्या होता है जैसे हम देखते हैं ए आई सी टी ए आई सी टी और जैसे हम एन बी एक्रीडेशन के लिए बहुत सारे कॉलेजेस जाते हैं ए आई सी टी अप्रूवल के लिए जाते हैं ए आई सी टी दैट इज ऑल इंडिया टेक्निकल काउंसिल ऑफ एजुकेशन राइट तो ये जो है टेक्निकल एजुकेशन काउंसिल जो है ये इट इज वन ऑफ द एंटिटी हु लुक आफ्टर फॉर ऑल द एक्टिविटीज टू बी डिलीवर्ड वेरी इफिशियंटली फ्रॉम अ पर्टिकुलर टेक्निकल एंड प्रोफेशनल कोर्सेस ये क्यों होता है उन्होंने बहुत सारे नॉर्म्स और क्लॉजेस उन्होंने डाले हुए हैं उसमें एक क्लॉज और नॉर्म है इंटर्नशिप एनकरेज यूर स्टूडेंट्स टू डू मोर एंड मोर इंटर्नशिप इन अ इंडस्ट्री राइट जैसे हम देखते हैं कि फ्रेशर को एक्सपीरियंस नहीं है दैट इज ट्रू और उसको कभी एक्सपीरियंस रहेगा भी नहीं अनलेस एंड एंटिली स्टार्ट द जॉब तो उसके अल्टरनेटिव जो है हमने बनाए हुए हैं वो अल्टरनेटिव है इंडस्ट्री बेस्ड यू नो ट्रेनिंग प्रोग्राम्स इंडस्ट्री बेस्ड लाइव प्रोजेक्ट इंडस्ट्री बेस्ड इंटर्नशिप ये अगर हम ऑल्टरनेटिव uh, काफी सिंसियरली uh, अडॉप्ट करते हैं और इसको हम uh, करते हैं ड्यूरिंग आर ग्रेजुएशन और राइट आफ्टर ग्रेजुएशन उसके बेसिस पे यू मे गेट अपॉर्चुनिटी फॉर द बिगिनिंग लेवल एम्प्लॉय जैसे अर्शद सर ने भी बताया कि लर्निंग डेटा साइंस इन अयर और सिक्स मंथ टाइम पीरियड वोट बी इनफ टू गिव यू दैट यू नो सर्टिफिकेशन दैट यू आर द परफेक्ट डेटा साइंटिस्ट और यू आर द एक्सपीरियंस डेटा साइंटिस्ट इट मे नॉट बी इनफ बट लर्निंग इट फॉर सिक्स मंथ और वन ईयर विल डेफिनेटली गिव यू एंट्री लेवल ऑफ जॉब इन अ इंडस्ट्री so along with the well experienced well versed people who are working in that particular company you can also work as a assistant where you won't be needing uh, to be told every time ki ye karo wo karo aisa karo waisa karo or you won't be needing any kind of additional training you won't be needing any kind of additional assistant to do the uh, you know assistant level job Getting it? वो आपको जरूरत नहीं पड़ेगी तो कंपनी वोट बी नीडिंग टू स्पेंड टाइम ऑन यू और वोट बी नीडिंग स्पेंड मनी टू ट्रेन यू राइट तो आप एंट्री लेवल बिगिनिंग लेवल का एज अ असिस्टेंट जॉब कर सकते हो जूनियर इंजीनियर जॉब कर सकते हो ग्रेजुएट ट्रेनिंग इंजीनियर जॉब कर सकते हो इन रिस्पेक्ट ऑफ योर क्वालिफिकेशन यू माइट बी फ्रॉम अ बी एस सी बैकग्राउंड इट डजेंट मीन दैट यू गो यू डो यू आर नॉट एबल टू गो इन टू इन आई टी इंडस्ट्री तो वो बिगिनिंग लेवल का आप जॉब हमेशा से ले सकते हो अगर आपको एक्सपीरियंस नहीं है तो एक्सपीरियंस का अल्टरनेटिव ढूंढो अल्टरनेटिव है बेस्ट इंटर्नशिप प्रोग्राम्स बेस्ट ट्रेनिंग प्रोग्राम्स बेस्ट यू नो प्रोजेक्ट्स अंडर दी एक्सपर्ट्स अंडर दी यू नो वेल एक्सपीरियंस गाइस सो दैट विल हैपन ओनली व्हेन यू एनरोल इन अ प्रोग्राम वेन वेयर ऑल दिस डिलीवरेबल्स आर यू नो आर यू नो डिलीवर्ड एट एट देयर एफिशिएंसी एट देयर यू नो प्रॉमिसिंग लेवल सो इफ ऑल दो थिंग हैपन देन डेफिनेटली ऑल योर कंसर्न विल बी गेटिंग वैनिश्ड एंड यू विल गेट इन टू इन इंडस्ट्री बिकॉज इन सच न्यू एज टेक्नोलॉजी एंड न्यू एज इंडस्ट्री वी डू नॉट हैव इनफ अमाउंट और इनफ नंबर ऑफ ह्यूमन रिसोर्सेज यू नो टू बी सोर्स टू अ इंडस्ट्री तो दे आर हेल्पलेस इंडस्ट्रीज हेल्पलेस है हर बार उनको एक्सपीरियंस कैंडिडेट मिले और उतने हाई अमाउंट पे एक्सपीरियंस कैंडिडेट हायर करना उनके लिए भी अफोर्डेबल फिजिबल नहीं है तो व्हाट इज अल्टरनेटिव फॉर देम इज अल्टरनेटिव फॉर देम इज टू हायर द ट्रेन्ड पीपल और द स्टूडेंट हु इज डन एटलीस्ट सिक्स मंथ और थ्री मंथ इंटर्नशिप फ्रॉम ए इंडस्ट्री उनको हायर करो दे अनफॉर्चुनेटली दो डोंट रिस्पॉन्ड टू अ फ्रेश इंजीनियर्स और फ्रेश ग्रेजुएट्स उनको हायर करना उनके लिए लाइबिलिटी बन जाता है तो वो लोग भी अल्टरनेटिव ढूंढते हैं कि एक्सपीरियंस लोगों को इतने अमाउंट पे या इतने हायर नंबर पे हम रिक्रूट नहीं कर सकते तो चलो इंटर्न्स देखते हैं या फिर हम ऐसे कोई कैंडिडेट्स देखते हैं जिन्होंने ऐसे एडवांस ट्रेनिंग प्रोग्राम्स कर रखे है या सर्टिफाइड हो रखे है या फिर उन्होंने पर्टिकुलर सिक्स मंथ वन ईयर टाइम पीरियड स्पेंड किया है प्रैक्टिस में प्रैक्टिस में प्रैक्टिकल्स में ऐसे वो कैंडिडेट ढूंढते हैं और बहुत लार्ज लेवल पे ढूंढ रहे हैं इट्स अ हंटिंग इट्स अ बिग हंटिंग बाय द एम्प्लॉयर 
उस हंटिंग का पार्ट आपको बनना है इफ यू रियली वॉन्ट टू गेट इन टू इन इंडस्ट्री यू हैव टू गेट इन टू इन दिस न्यू एज टेक्नोलॉजी एंड आई आई एम वेरी श्योर विद विथ लर्निंग ऑफ दिस न्यू एज टेक्नोलॉजी यू विल मेक यूर मेंटर्स प्राउड यूल मेक यूर पेरेंट्स प्राउड बाय हैविंग अ एक्सिलेंट जॉब विद द एक्सिलेंट पैकेजेस राइट सो दैट्स ऑल आई वॉन्टेड टू यू नो डिस्कस विद द स्टूडेंट्स Uh, I'm sure uh, the students who have attended our uh, today's session will take the maximum advantages out of it, right? Uh, and uh, uh, you know, whatever future assistance you need from our side, we are there to support you. Uh, please keep in touch with us. Uh, I would request my backend team to share the contact details with the students so that uh, in future, if they are stuck anywhere or if they are, uh, you know, looking forward any kind of internship or a industry-based program, we can help them up. right guys thank you so much that's all from my side if you have any queries or doubts you can ask me apart from uh, you know technical if you have any queries related to your career or what should do after bsc uh, what kind of uh, practices should be happening and what are the best practices which can be done by the fresh graduates this kind of questions you can definitely ask thank you very much sir Uh, thank you for enlightening and motivating the students dear participants you can ask the questions if any yes if any questions sir which kind of company uh, is good a service based company or a product based company uh your name would you would you please tell me your name samruddhi samruddhi uh, see uh, we cannot uh, you know categorically say that whether the product based company is good or the service based uh, company is good right so uh, in a both side you have to only look after uh, you, sorry you have to only look at the opportunity what they are giving you right if you are in a product line based uh, where you may go for the r&d or a, a product development if you are into in a service uh, you may uh, become a uh, you know application developer or a Uh, you know software developer or a, you know uh, uh, what i can say uh, in a back end level you can get the uh, jobs right so categorically we cannot say whether the company uh, which is service based is good or whether the company which is uh, product based is good you have to look for the brand you have to look for their establishment how company uh, how well company is established what are their investors what are their clientele base and how efficiently they are working in a uh, that particular domain and what are their uh, you know employees feedback that all you have to look for and today we have so many uh, sources to understand uh, whether the employees of that company are really happy they are getting regular salaries they are they are having a good uh, uh, you know uh, hr policies or a uh, employee welfare policies that you can uh, simply check with the uh, sources like a glassdoor and Uh, many other options are there right in fact naukri.com have also started this that uh, whenever you are uploading your cv or uh, taking the services from naukri.com naukri.com will promptly ask you a feedback about your current uh, employer right so you can get the feedback uh, from the companies uh, uh, feedback of the companies from a different sources right so both the companies are equally good whether it is product based or the service based so only you have to check is whether the company's background Uh, in terms of uh, uh, their employee policies employee welfare policies and uh, uh, in terms of their uh, you know other additional benefits are good or not right that you have to check hello sir yes what are the basic uh, requirement for internships yes uh, i hope uh, yes uh, you understand whatever has been told or explained by arshad sir uh, that you understood very well right इंटर्नशिप yes, uh, जैसे हम देखते हैं कि आप लोग बी में हो uh, और uh, जो बी के स्टूडेंट होते हैं दे आर यू नो डिफरेंट इन एक्स्ट्रा करिकुलम एक्टिविटीज बी में uh, जो हमारे कन्वेंशनल uh, प्रोग्राम्स uh, है जिसको हम नॉन प्रोफेशनल कोर्सेज कहेंगे उसमें हमें इस इंटर्नशिप का या फिर एड ऑन सर्टिफिकेशन या फिर कुछ इंडस्ट्री बेस्ड प्रोग्राम इसका बहुत ज्यादा एक्सपोजर नहीं मिलता है बिकॉज Uh, there is no entity like AICT who is imposing rules. लेकिन B में AICT जैसे UGC जैसे बहुत सारे entities है uh, authorities है जो बहुत सारे rules impose करते हैं उस rules के imposition के चलते colleges uh, mandatorily कुछ activities बच्चों से करवाती है 
बट उसमें भी मैं देखना देखता हूं कि इंजीनियरिंग बैकग्राउंड के स्टूडेंट्स को इंटर्नशिप नहीं मिल रही है दे आर फेल टू गेट द इंटर्नशिप इन अ इंडस्ट्री बिकॉज वन हु इज लुकिंग फॉर अ इंटर्नशिप इफ ही अप्लाइज टू अ पर्टिकुलर कंपनी दैट कंपनी इज नॉट एंटरटेनिंग देम वेरी पॉजिटिवली राइट सो इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर यू यश to get a proper channel for the internship, right? एक individual basis पे आप internship करने जाओगे कि मैं so and so student हूं so and so college से मेरा graduation होगा हो गया है मुझे internship चाहिए तो you may not get the response, right response from the company. So it is very important for you to, you know, get the uh, beginning level training on the knowledge of that particular technology on which you are going to do the internship. For example, आप डेटा साइंस के लिए इंटर्नशिप करने जा रहे हैं किसी कंपनी में तो वो कंपनी भी आपको एज ए इंटर्न तभी एंटरटेन करेगी जब आप उस डेटा साइंस के टूल्स टेक्निक्स और पर्टिकुलर यू नो बैकहेंड यू नो टेक्नोलॉजी पे कुछ हैंड्स ऑन एक्सपीरियंस लेके है या फिर कुछ नॉलेज लेके है राइट right? जैसे आप बी कर रहे हैं तो यश मैं जानना चाहूंगा बी कौन से ग्रुप में कर रहे हैं पी कंप्यूटर साइंस एंड मैथ्स इज इन्वॉल्व कंप्यूटर साइंस एंड मैथ्स तो जो कंप्यूटर साइंस एंड मैथ्स आप बीएससी में कर रहे हैं वो कंप्यूटर साइंस और मैथ्स के बेसिस पे आपके लिए शायद ये बहुत बहुत चैलेंजिंग हो जाएगा कि किसी डेटा साइंस रिलेटेड या क्लाउड टेक्नोलॉजी रिलेटेड कंपनी में मैं या आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस रिलेटेड कंपनी में मैं इंटर्नशिप लू क्योंकि आपका बेस ही नहीं है आपका बैकग्राउंड ही नहीं है तो आपके लिए बहुत ज्यादा जरूरी है पहले छोटे मोटे यू नो ट्रेनिंग प्रोग्राम या फिर नॉलेज ले ले लीजिए उस टेक्नोलॉजी पे देन यू प्रेजेंट योर प्रोफाइल देयर इन दैट कंपनी सेइंग कि आई हैव डन दिस 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 काइंड ऑफ प्रैक्टिसेस आई हैव डन दिस काइंड ऑफ प्रैक्टिकल्स एंड आई हैव गॉट दिस काइंड ऑफ नॉलेज यू नो वो प्रोफाइल लेके आप अगर आप जाओगे तो कंपनी विल डेफिनेटली यू नो पॉजिटिवली रिस्पॉन्डिंग यू एंड विल गिव दिल गिव यू द इंटर्नशिप फैसिलिटी राइट right. तो प्री रिक्वेस्ट जैसे आपने मुझे पूछा कि सर इंडस्ट्री में इंटर्नशिप लेने के लिए कोई प्री रिक्वेस्ट है क्या यस वी डू हैव इट अगर आप पर्टिकुलर डेटा साइंस से रिलेटेड इंडस्ट्री में जा रहे हैं डेटा साइंस का बेसिक नॉलेज यू नो या मिनिमम बेयर नॉलेज लेके आपको जाना पड़ेगा आप आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस के लिए जा रहे हैं या क्लाउड इंटेलिज क्लाउड टेक्नोलॉजी के लिए जा रहे हैं उसका नॉलेज आपको लेके जाना पड़ेगा वेदर यू डू इट फ्रॉम एनी प्राइवेट इंस्टीट्यूट और यू डू इट फ्रॉम द सेंटर लाइक नागपुर यूनिवर्सिटीज क्लाउड एंड डेटा सेंटर डेटा साइंस सेंटर राइट यहां से करो कहीं से भी करो तो वो करके आपको इंटर्नशिप काफी इजीली मिल जाता है राइट एंड देर आर द इंस्टीट्यूट लाइक नागपुर यूनिवर्सिटी जैसे इंस्टीट्यूट है जो बच्चों को नॉलेज देने के साथ साथ बच्चों को इंडस्ट्री इंटरफेस भी दे रहे हैं इंडस्ट्री में इंटर्नशिप भी ऑफर कर रहे हैं तो यू कैन स्टेट अवे रिस्पॉन्ड टू आर यू नो प्रोग्राम through which you will get a internship also and a post internship you will get a job also in a industry yes sir right thank you sir thank you yash any other questions okay thank you very much sir once again uh, for guiding uh, our uh, participants and uh, providing uh, information Uh, regarding uh, career opportunities thank you very much sir now i request a respected professor sr pandey sir head of the computer science department science college congress nagar nagpur for his presentation remark please sir pandey sir yes sir so <clears throat> first of all i pay my homage to the founder president of sishwajishan society um and the first agriculture minister government of india dr punjab rawal has bhousak deshmukh social reformer uh, rashtra sant tukloji maharaj uh, rashtra rashtra sant uh, gadge maharaj mahagade saraswati respected dignitaries of this webinar chairman of the webinar uh, our enthusiastic principal dr rip dhore sir uh, <coughs> today the resource person uh, harsh sharif dr harsh sharif sir uh, who is the academic head of the uh, department of cloud technology obera center for excellence at university second resource person uh, dr uh, mr anil tatur training officers uh, 
आरटीएम में तो रोबोटिक्स डिपार्टमेंट एंड माय डियर टीचिंग नॉन टीचिंग स्टाफ एंड माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स द ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ दिस वेबिनार इज टू इंटरेक्ट द वेल नोन एकेडेमिशियन एंड इंडस्ट्री पर्सन टू शेयर देयर नॉलेज ऑफ द करंट टेक्नोलॉजीज विद द स्टूडेंट्स टू अवेयर अबाउट द करंट टेक्नोलॉजीज इन द इंडस्ट्रीज so when well, <clears throat> today uh, we got the uh, well known um, academician uh, dr harshad uh, sharif sir okay uh, he is having that the 15 years uh, uh, teaching uh, and uh, industry experience and he is a uh, well expertise in the artificial intelligence and machine learning so he nicely explained about the data science so he nicely explained the uh, data science tools uh, data science algorithms okay uh, what are the different projects in the data science and what are the career opportunities in the uh, data science definitely sir our students will uh, get the uh, benefit from uh, your knowledge uh, <coughs> second resource person uh, uh, anil tatode sir okay, who nicely explained the uh, job opportunities in the local industries okay as as well as uh, uh, nicely interacted with the students uh, well uh, arshad sharif sir nicely interacted with the students okay nicely explained the difference between the machine learning and the artificial intelligence so well <coughs> dear students computer science having the number of subjects so it's a wide spectrum Okay, so there are the so many languages in the computer science, so many databases. So we cannot actually, uh, as a academician or at the university level, we cannot accommodate all these things in a, a three-year or four four-year degree course. So so we can uh, in the university course having the basic things. Okay, so but industries require the current technologies. So you have to acquire the knowledge from the different platforms. So well. government of india launched the uh, nptel platform okay for the online learning so well you can learn the uh, data, uh, data science courses you can learn the python r programming courses from the um, swayam nptel okay at the uh, free of cost okay and you can uh, uh, acquire the knowledge and you will become the skillful <coughs> again uh, there are uh, again um, internship program is also on that the net okay so if you apply through the linkedin uh, to the various hr persons of the industry okay so even they have also for you the internship program so well <coughs> in this way uh, such a types of guest lectures uh, will be helpful to you for acquiring the uh, current uh, industry uh, demands Okay. and uh, here i am also congratulating the uh, dr kc sir and dr vandari sir for nicely organizing this webinar okay and i hope that in the future okay both of you will work to organize the such a lectures and it will be helpful to the student okay thank you thank you very much i conclude my lecture thank you respected panesh sir uh, thank you very much Yes. Now I would like to call upon my colleague, uh, Dr. M. T. Vanjari sir, to propose vote of thanks. Yes, Vanjari sir. Yes, sir. Uh, thank you, sir. Uh, good afternoon to all. I, Dr. Marish Vanjari, uh, feel great honor and privilege to propose the vote of thanks on this uh, wonderful webinar. First of all, uh, I thank our special resource person, Dr. Arshad Sharif sir. Academic Head, Department of Cloud, Depart Cloud Technology, Oberai Center of Excellence, at AMU Nagpur, uh, University Nagpur, and uh, uh, Mr. Anil Tatode Sir, Training Officer, Department of Robotics and Cloud Technology, at AMU uh, Nagpur, who, despite their busy schedule, has found time to grace this uh, webinar and valuable inf informations about the essence of uh, data science and opportunities for graduates. and uh, i also express my heartfelt thank to our uh, honorable principal professor mp dore sir for this valuable guidance 
uh, and i thank our hod professor sr pandey sir for their valuable guidance and support for this function uh, i also thank dr jk kech sir for uh, conduction of this uh, wonderful session and uh, last but not least i thank all staff members of computer science department and uh, most important my dear students participants once again i thank you all for your attention thank you thank you thank all. you so much sir thank you uh, sir. thank you uh, thank you sir vanay sir and thank you uh, yes, sir person sir uh, now dear participants you can obtain the certificate of participation after filling pizza form yeah. the link of the same is already uh, i am now i am now uh, 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 jageshwar sir, jageshwar sir uh, sorry to interrupt ah, yes sir yes, yes. Uh, yes, sorry yes, to yes. interrupt you. Uh, I think there is a question from uh, one of the students, uh, Niharika, from your college. Uh, okay. You know who is uh, who is asking uh, that uh, what uh, kind of program we should opt for right after BSc and where to learn a data science. So Niharika, I hope you got uh, uh, you know uh, uh, got my uh, counselor's number. so you can get in touch with them uh, they will uh, let you know that how our one year pg diploma in data science will help the students uh, uh, right after bsc to get the jobs in industry so please get in touch with them through our mobile number uh, and jageshwar sir uh, from our uh, department of nagpur university uh, i would also like to you know extend my gratitude to the entire uh, team of your esteemed organization and college i am really thankful to honorable principal of your uh, you know uh, college stem to college and the other staff members for giving us this opportunity to interact with the students and uh, i can tell you one thing that the way your students are uh, uh, students have interacted to our resource person arshad sarif that was really appreciable it shows uh, the students are very much dedicated and involved in such kind of activities Uh, which is really remarkable and appreciable uh, appreciable i would really like to appreciate yash uh, samruddhi uh, uh, then rishikesh uh, niharika for their interaction and uh, queries so that's really something great uh, uh, you also must appreciate your students thanks to uh, our enthusiastic student for their active participation and lesson uh, lis patience listening of our session thank you so much sir and i would like to wish you. all the best to all your students for their future endeavors thank you sir yes sir definitely thank you thank you very much sir now dear participants you can obtain the certificate of participation after filling the feedback form the link of the same is already shared in the chat box also we will share the feedback form link in your email id once again thank you uh, dr arshad sharif sir anil uh, tatode sir for your precious talk it is my proud privilege to thank the convener professor sr pandey sir and uh, for his uh, guidance and i am very much thankful to chairman of today's event honorable uh, principal professor mb dore sir for his motivation and support thank you once again and uh, all dear participants thank you thank you very much sir uh, sir pandey sir can i uh, can i conclude